Well, there was a light coming from the Crowland County Fairgrounds on Friday, but it wasn't lighting from the storms. It was a light of hope as the Relay for Life of Crowland County was put on to raise money for the American Cancer Society, as well as celebrate those who have beaten cancer and remember those we've lost to cancer. The event itself, however, was cut short due to the severe storms that rolled through the area on Friday night. While the opening ceremonies went on without issue, the storms affected many of the other festivities, cutting straight to the important luminaria ceremony and closing ceremonies five hours earlier than planned. In the, the beginning of the ceremony, we, we managed to do some of our ceremony outside before the storm came, and then we moved inside for the dinner, and then uh, during the dinner, uh, the, store came, the storm uh, showed up and, and we had to improvise a little bit, go to plan B and uh, have our luminaria ceremony inside a building, which I feel went very well too. It was fun giving the speech. I really enjoyed it. I, I wrote out my emotions. I wrote out my story. And after the speech, what was most fun about it is people came up to me and said they really related to what I had said. They felt uh, a lot of the words that I used were very appropriate to them, as well as uh, just me writing them. Relay for Life events are held all across the country throughout the year. If you've enjoyed this segment of Lakeland News, please consider making a tax-deductible contribution to Lakeland Public Television.